Jake co-host this the uh, our favorite little goblin <laughs> found his goblinette. <laughs> no offense, Rachel. Uh, <laughs> yeah. She doesn't look like a goblin. No, I don't think she. Yeah. I mean, uh, I don't. She doesn't mind. Yeah. You can call okay. Her. Okay. Um, but yeah, I found my little goblinette. That's great. Uh, yeah. Congrats. Met her, met her on the pickleball courts about a year ago and uh, took her to the same park. Not on the pickleball courts. Um, I didn't propose to her in the kitchen or anything. Right. Um, it was it was a park with like water and stuff. Okay. It okay. looks very nice. Not Fall just the trees. courts. Like, could it, Gl- Gladys, could you hold? Uh, Dean, can you not serve for a second? I'm going to... Pro- sorry, just real quick here. <laughs> just, had a, you know, from the day I first met you in the bedroom, like, <laughs> like, could you hold? Someone okay, we did it. Beautiful park. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, but it was a lot of fun. A lot of fun. I saw someone commented. They're like, whoa, congratulations. So does this mean Rachel joins Correct Opinions now? I like, love what people come up with. Like, like yes, she's going to quit kind of her okay. career, what she's got going on. Podcaster now. Yeah. That's so yeah. cool you married Katie's sister. <laughs> <laughs> Happy for you guys. Like, I guess you had wow. to divorce Lindsay or Morgan to make right. this happen. So the whole Everything's ordeal. either related or married or, uh-huh. yeah. I used to I used to date Derek. Yeah. Um, yeah. It's, it's, it's yeah. all related somehow. You had Very asked Rachel's, here. Yeah. <laughs> had asked Rachel's dad for his blessing, Brad. <laughs> <laughs> It's just a whole. <laughs> no, he took it well. Uh, so it was funny. fun. It was fun. Uh, I might have been just as nervous asking for the blessing as I was asking <clears throat> for the the actual hand in marriage. It is, I mean, it's a cool experience, but it feels good. It's a nice exhale, right? Yeah, it's, it was it's like pretty overwhelming. I know the weeks. answer I'm gonna get. I know that her parents love me. I know that we're all good, but it's like still just starting that conversation. Like, all right, we just got done golfing. How do I transition into? I would like to spend the rest of my life with your daughter. Right. And, you know, there's just not like an easy like ramp up to more serious mm-hmm. things. It just went straight from like, yeah, that the greens were tricky today. I got a question, Steve. <laughs> um, yeah, you'll be happy to know. You just kind of do that one thing, and then you're right back to just like uh, the the Cowboys this year. <laughs> So it's nice. I had to be intimate with my father-in-law once, never again. Good. Yes. Get it out of the way. <laughs> no, we just we have nice, day. pleasant combos. Yes, yes, yes. After we had the it's conversation, good. which this would have been months ago or whatever, but it was like, great, full conversation. He's like, all right, awesome, Jake. Let's let's get inside. And he's like, wait, so I, we didn't talk with, so like, don't tell anyone? And I was like, no, you should definitely like tell your wife, right? Like, <laughs> like definitely <laughs> tell her. Tell her. And like, you can tell, I, you tell whoever you want. Just don't tell Rachel, right? Mm-hmm. Like, it was just so funny to me that he was just like, I, I won't tell anyone if you don't want. Mm-hmm. I'll die before I tell anyone. <laughs> I was like, no, you could probably tell Angie. <laughs> Maybe some of your family. I'd run it by her. Yeah, it was great. He was sworn to secrecy. So he just hits you up the next week. He's like, this is kind of why I didn't want to tell her, but she actually is not cool with it. <laughs> so I don't know what that throws a wrinkle in your plans. But I won't tell anyone that this is all going yeah. on. All right. You got my word. So I told her I made it up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's awesome, man. Congrats. Yes, that's yes. that's Congrats. a great. Uh, Super exciting. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, it was fun. When did, do you remember back? When did you propose, Derek? How many years ago was that? Why do you got to do that to me? Oh, man. <laughs> it's uh, not that long ago. Yikes. Five. We got married five years ago. Okay. So Derek's just going off what he knows. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and work backwards. You, you can text I, her if you need to. Yeah. <laughs> I proposed uh, at the Kaufman Center. We had a Ooh, nice, beautiful. Yeah. I've, I've seen pretty. a couple people do that. If you guys are not from Kansas City, Derek said the Coffin Center. The Coffin. Um, it's uh, <laughs> it's a funeral home, mm, yes. uh, yeah. but it's a nice like, one. I'm gonna I'm gonna be with you till we're here. <laughs> till death do us part. <laughs> it's romantic. I did drop the green the the ring and grass. Right mm. before I asked. So then she saw me like fumbling around trying to find it. Right. It was like he's very in touch very with the smooth. spirits. Yes. <laughs> it's like, oh, we're going to be buried right here. Right here. This is like, the plot. What kind of grass is this? I'm trying to figure it out. <laughs> she knew exactly what I was doing. Really? Yeah, yeah that's funny. That's great. Trey, yeah. when did you propose? Mm-hmm. Lit- <coughs> oh, excuse me. September 2nd oh, gosh. of 2019. Good job. I have to think a lot. There's a lot of times when like we first. Met in 2018. Yes. Yeah. Good, good times. Good job. Good, good job. times. <laughs> Man, it's weird. Getting old. I've, I've, I'm, I'm hitting my third year old crisis, I think. He really is. He's asked me like probably four times in the past, you know, two weeks. Do we look old? <laughs> we do. Somebody, but I like how that he says we, not just like do together. I. We've established do, you do. do we. but am I catching up to you? I I've just in the past couple in the past couple weeks, I had a buddy send like I'm starting to get like we all have that friend who's still on the time hop app. Oh yeah, yeah and he's like check this out. This was us five years ago on Halloween. Like 
there's a difference in my face. Oh, there I is. See, I there see. is. So you think it's like physically how your body shape? I don't know if it was like you're at a tailgate and you're like, oh, these people seem younger than us. No, you're my face. So, just your, how you look. <laughs> my face yeah. and the, the hair is connected to it. The in the face. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I had another buddy. They're like, dude, I was looking through our group message in our fantasy football and found this gym of videos from like three years ago. I was like, oh. Don't send me that. Yeah. Yeah. Fine. I'm happy with it. I'm about to turn 30. Are you happy with it? I feel like there's more to this. No, I, I feel like there's a crisis coming. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. I did it too. It's fine. I'll get you through it. Yeah, just, we're all thirty, but you. Yeah, just comment below that I'm uh, handsome. Yeah, please. He young, needs, he young, needs some <laughs> alabaster need it. skin. When you shave the beard, you take off five years of your. Oh, life. thanks for noticing. That was yeah. part of the crisis. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I trimmed the beard. Maybe that was why. It really does take mm-hmm. off like, several years. That is funny. And I'm kind of like, well, I don't want you to look. Way younger than me. That's you it. Know? I'm about to start going uh, just a straight razor shave every morning. I don't. Keep I it young. truly. I don't think I've ever seen you with a straight razor sa- shave. I did it that one time. It wasn't a straight razor, but it was down to nothing. It was yeah, but there was still like a little stubble. Who, it, very few people do that these days. Well, these guys do. You, you guys take a razor or what? Are, what are we using? Electric razor. Mm. Yeah. Those sh- tear my skin to bits. Oh really? Like yeah. irritate it? Yeah. Mm. I've never been able. Are you a razor guy, Derek? Or? Uh, Dollar Shave Club still. Okay. Yeah. All right. If they want to sponsor. Yeah, Katie? sponsor her. <laughs> oh, um, yeah, just razor to the face usually. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Girls yeah. do that though, right? That actually dermaplaning is a thing now. Yeah. Is that what you do? We just call it something different. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I like <laughs> girls dermaplane. Like you're just, you're shaving like shaving the rest of us. <laughs> I actually had that done like twice to my face where they just take off all the peach fuzz I mean, it feels nice, but also, Hair. <laughs> but that's what it is. Okay, yeah, a little yeah. blonde, but I'm just like beard. <laughs> yes, I shave. We derma plane our peach fuzz. <laughs> You're shaving your beard. I wasn't a huge fan. Mm. I was just like, you I like to have the scruff. I prefer the scruff. <laughs> okay. I think it ages me well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just like no, you. I think it's hot. Yeah. Well, that peach fuzz has been growing for you know 25 years, so it's it's kind of smooth, and then you shave it, and then it's kind of rough again. Mm-hmm. Right. And I'm not trying to get like a rough face here. So you're like kissing Trey. He's like ah scratchy. Yeah. Oh, it hurts. <laughs> She's cut a lump. Ah, give it another couple of days. <laughs> it's so scratchy. It irritates my skin. Like you're, I'm kissing an electric razor right now. Yeah. That's thir- This is 30. We're all shaving our beards to <laughs> yeah. look younger. 